comparing the capabilities of stealth-capable fifth-generation fighters between countries is an attraction in itself, such as the Russian fighter Su-57 and the United States, US, F-35 fighter aircraft into interesting things to talk about. Moreover, the two stealth fighters belonging to these two superpowers are predicted to be the mainstay of the strength of the Russian Air Fleet and the US Air Fleet. The fifth-generation stealth-capable Sukhoi Su-57 fighter was developed by the Sukhoi manufacturer for the Russian Air Force. Previously this fighter jet was named PAKFA. This fighter aircraft is designed or designed to replace the MiG-29 Fulcrum and Su-27 flanker fighters in the Russian air defense system. The F-35 Lightning II is a family of stealth multi fighters made by U.S. manufacturer Lockheed Martin. This single-seat, single-engine fighter is intended to carry out the air superiority and strike missions of the United States Air Force. Quoted from the Bulgarian military website, Mark Episkopos, a doctor who specializes in history and often analyzes Russian military technologies said that the Russian Su-57 fighter is equipped with excellent weapons and maintains a large number of air-to-air -air missiles and anti-ship missiles. Meanwhile, the US F-35 Lightning II, although slightly behind in missile armament when compared to the Russian Su-57, will receive new options for the selection of new missiles and bombs, including the B-61 Mod-12 with nuclear gravity bombs. However, the technology of the Su-57 fighter has advanced one step compared to the F-35. The Su-57 fighter has one definite advantage over its competitor the F-35, which is the use of Volkotnik drones. The Su-57 fighter is designed to have the ability to collaborate with Volkotnik drones to penetrate an enemy's air defenses and launch a bombardment. The F-35 fighter is equipped with a powerful and powerful nuclear gravity bomb. And that is an advantage an advantage if the enemy does not have it. But in fact, the Russian side also has a nuclear gravity bomb, so it can be a counterweight. Russian experts from UTRO.RU claim that the Okotnik attack drone is one of Russia's stealth heavy unmanned aerial combat vehicles or UCAV that can be armed with the equivalent of the US B-61 Mod-12 bomb. This drone is designed for the purpose of airstrikes on a massive scale once attacking the enemy immediately flat. However, so far there is no official information that Okotnik drones have been tested with nuclear gravity bombs. The Russian Sukhoi Su-57 is a fifth-generation fighter aircraft designed in a two-seat modification, one of which is tasked with controlling a group of Okotnik attack drones, a Russian defense industry source told TASS. To control Okotnik's advanced drones, a two-seat commando variant of the Su-57 fighter will be created. The fighter, already in the development stage, is expected to have the ability to control about four octonic drones, the source said. Earlier, United Aircraft Corporation, or UAC, told TASS, the latest Okotnik drones will be tasked with attacking air and ground targets in network-centric interaction with Su-57 fighters. Quoted from page 1945. The Su-57 fighter is certainly a larger aircraft when compared to the F-35 fighter. The Su-57 fighter is 72.2 feet long, or 21.8 feet longer than the F-35 fighter which is only 50.4 feet long. Likewise, the wingspan of the Su-57 is also much larger. The Su-57 weighs 40,786 pounds, while the F-35 weighs 29,002 pounds. Of course, the heavier weight will affect maneuverability and agility while flying, even though both aircraft are not heavy bombers. The larger fuselage and wings also make them bigger targets. The Su-57 fighter can fly at a maximum speed of 1,616 miles per hour or 2,600 kilometers per hour. Meanwhile, the US F-35 fighter can fly at a maximum speed of 1,199 miles per hour or 1,929 kilometers per hour. So technically the Su-57 fighter can attack first and escape. Moreover, the flight range of the Su-57 is more than double, about 3,107 miles, while the F-35 fighter has a range of 1,379 miles. However, the F-35 fighter is believed to have better stealth capabilities. 
This means the F-35 can target its enemy even before its presence is detected or known by the enemy. Therefore, the Su-57 fighter cannot strike first if it cannot see or know where the F-35 fighter is. However, Russia has a solution by having S-400 Triumph and S-500 Prometheus air defense systems to track and detect the location of U.S. stealth fighters. In recent years, the S-400 has performed well in tracking stealth fighters. Of the many defense weapons owned by Russia, among them are the S-400 and S-500 air defense systems. The two advanced missile systems are the mainstay of defense in guarding Moscow from enemy attacks. The S-400 system has even been purchased by several countries, including NATO member Turkey. The S-400 Triumph with the NATO nickname SA-21 Growler is an air defense missile system developed by Russia's Almaz Central Design Bureau. It is intended to replace Russia's S-300P and S-200 air defense systems. The S-400 is an upgrade of the S-300 series of air defense systems with surface-to-air missiles. This air defense missile system became operational in April 2007. Russia established four S-400 regiments to guard national airspace in the Moscow region, the Kaliningrad Baltic Exclave, and the Eastern Military District. Air defense units on the territory of the Southern Military District are also planned to be armed with S-400 advanced air defense missile systems. More than 20 S-400 battalions were delivered to the Russian Armed Forces in 2015. Russia also plans to establish 56 battalions of S-400 air defense missile systems. Russia intends to supply this system to China. In addition to China, Turkey also expressed its intention to purchase the S-400 air defense system upon its interest during the IDEF 2009 exhibition. This air defense missile system can destroy 80 targets at once using 160 missiles. The S-500 is a new generation of surface-to-air missile system, designed to intercept intercontinental ballistic missiles and for defense against airborne early warning and control, airborne warning and control system, and jamming aircraft.